on the other side of her but you can't see him because she's blocking him but I'm so glad she's eating at the table I'm liking this more and more every day I hope she continues to do it while I'm in North Carolina good morning everybody it's about 730 right now I just got up to use the restroom and checked my phone and I had a message from my sister they are going to do an open heart surgery on her. Um, she's doing okay, she says. Um, they're going to be running a few more tests on her this morning, and then they're going to let her know what time she is going in for her surgery. So I'm going to try and see if I can reach her by phone right now and talk to her a little bit. I asked her again if she wants me to come in to New York before I go to North Carolina and she said no that she has enough people there with her so she's gonna be okay um, kinda scary kinda hard I lost my other sister back in 2003 um, I know we're all getting older I know we all pass away at some point but it's never easy So. Good morning. Why is it starting on me? Well, first of all, it's not morning. It's afternoon. Okay, well. And I already did the good morning when I got up at 7.30, I think, or 8.30. I don't remember what time it all was. All right, so today is... I, I hate saying this all the time. Not a good day. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, so I, we called the, uh, the unemployment department, and they said that my claim is still open. Till December, there just isn't any money in it anymore. So there's apparently nothing I can do to change that. And I can't up reapply until December. So for the next half a year, um, I've got nothing coming in. So um, what I'm going to have to do, I do have some stocks. I'm going to have to cash those out. I was hoping not to do that because um, it uh, would cause issues with unemployment again, but I, I, they tell me it won't because even though it was uh, money, I'm still not employed. That's the, that's the thing. Uh, things are getting a little desperate right now. Uh, we have to, the um, stocks will probably keep us going for a little while, but um, it won't last until December. Um, so, um, that's that's where we are with that. Um, I'm going to. Um, Mom's coming over to pick me up. We're going to go over to the county and see if there's anything they can do to help us. And we're going to cash out my uh, my stocks. Maybe I'll. I don't think I can do anything with my 401k. Um, I might be able to cash it out because I'm 56. Isn't that early retirement? I don't know. You'd have to look into it. So that's something I'm going to have to look into as well. And there's a not a lot in there either, but uh, every little bit's yeah. going to help. So that's where I stand. What I really want and really need is a job, and I'm not getting anywhere. So we're going to have to take stock of what, how much I we need to keep the house, and I'm going to have to go out there and get any job. That, uh, that'll do that basically so so this is a probably a terrible time for me to be going back to North Carolina but I really have no choice but while Kevin is over at the county office I don't know if I need to be with him for this or not I'm hoping not um, he's gonna discuss food stamps um, hopefully that'll help us out with we can get that and that'll help us out with some food for the house um, 
cashing in his stocks and his 401k, like he said. That'll help us with the house for a little while longer. Um, selling as much as we can possibly sell on eBay. You know, we have all you wonderful people that have been helping us, and we do greatly appreciate everything you guys do. Um, it's just so much right now, and it, it, it's just more and more and more piling on top, and it, it's getting hard. It's getting really, really hard, but we're doing what we can. And everybody wonders why I get cat hair in my face. Nobody wonders that. You're just a cat. I think she likes being a pet instead of wandering around outside hmm. fending for her own food. I don't know. She probably had like five or six houses that she would go and get various meals. Yeah, but but she wouldn't get this. She wouldn't get all this rubs. <laughs> and she wouldn't be able to do this to anybody. <laughs> well, that's, that's what she gets. Cat hair. <laughs> you scared him. That's that one scaredy cat. Boomer! Don't go. <laughs> That's the first time I've seen him actually play with a laser. God, you guys are no fun! Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages. That's right, I got my top hat on again. I have to say it like that. Yeah, boy. Got my hat on backwards, that's why I have to say that. Oh, oh, well, is that it? That's it. I'm the, I'm the ringleader of this circus going on around here. Sorry, it was kind of a downer today. Um, we got some more bad news that we're not at liberty to talk about. And uh, just kind of keeps piling on more and more. And uh, we talked about all the uh, unemployment stuff and all that. So, yeah, you guys know everything that's going on. So, anyway, um, <laughs> I know there wasn't much to like, but if you liked watching our negative video today, please give us a thumbs up. You saw Boomer tire himself out <laughs> in three seconds. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. And you saw Mojo run away from a laser light. Scared him. <laughs> you did see Mama eating at the dining room table. That's always exciting. Hey. <laughs> so anyway, give this video a great big thumbs up. Hit that little red subscribe button down below and follow along with us. And share this video with your family and friends because, you know, they may need a good night's rest too and we can bore anybody to sleep. <laughs> we'll catch you guys all tomorrow.